ACM Nesiaya, I Tanashqualawan, E. Quick Quits Nalatst, and the Sitia Ama, the Mana, Quet Sintoya, E. Siatmak Slahotsiam, the Amoth, Quetan Sakalot, E. Slahotsiam, Meetsa, Meetsa, Kutwilam, Tanantamoch, Tanahuenelmoch. Greetings to our honored guests and, and my dear ones. I have good feelings in my heart to see all of you today. In our language, I told you my name is Sitsia Ama. I told you who my parents are. I told you who my grandparents are because in our way, that um, family tree, that genealogy is really important for people to know know who I am. And on behalf of the Koselish people, I, w I welcome you to Koselish traditional territory, thanking all of you for joining us this evening. And now I would like to call upon my good friend, Renee Wissett, to introduce you to Robert. Thank you, Leah. A beautiful welcome as you, as always. And um, also acknowledging the territory and glad that everybody came out tonight in this very cold and wet night. It is with much honor that I am here to introduce Thulfit Robert Morales. Um, Robert Morales is a Coast Salish member of the Cowichan First Nations. He is currently the chief negotiator of the Halkaminam Treaty Group and advocate for First Nations generally throughout Canada. Robert has a Bachelor of Science from Brigham Young, a JD Law degree from the University of Victoria, and a diploma in negotiations from Harvard. He's practiced law for several years as advocate for Aboriginal people. Then he became to the Halkaminam Treaty Group as their chief negotiator and has been there for several years, 14 years, I believe. He's been a longtime advocate for Aboriginal rights. He has many um, stripes under his belt, such as helping First Nations get control of their child welfare agencies and empowering them to make decisions over child welfare versus the province who had intervened, of course, for several years. I think one of the greatest things Mr. Morales is um, proud to have is a large family of seven children that are now young leaders in the community and huge advocates across Canada for Aboriginal rights. Myself personally, I'm very happy to introduce him and feel honored to even know him because of his ability to argue and to fight for Aboriginal people in such a positive, good way. He is always sure to work with the Crown and other, uh, other people to ensure that he works with them to educate them in a very respectful way and inform his sometimes opponents about Aboriginal rights. He's got this crazy energy. He's highly tactical, highly patient. He's hardworking and he's very, very committed to the Aboriginal cause. I introduce you, Philthet. 